Hello, everyone. Hello. It is. It is a. It is a day. <laughs> yes, it is. It a is. day of fantasy and havoc. The two best things, isn't it? Final Fantasy and havoc. It is. I'm just uh, setting out the uh, everything, and then we can go. And possibly die in a dungeon. No, hello, lag. Nice oh, hey, now you can see the stream. You can see the good old BB shot. Oh my god. Yeah. Really annoying, right? Is my eye protection stopped there. And the face mask started there. It was oh. literally one shot. I've actually got one up here as well. It kind of went bang, bang, bang. Fucking annoyed. Oh my god. Fucking annoyed. And that's the only one that bled. So mad. That looks like it hurts like a banshee shit. It did at the time. I, I definitely felt it. Oh, I'm sure you felt it. There's no, <laughs> there's no question you felt that. Holy crap. Good that the asshole got yeeted after that shit. Cause yeah. Fuck that shit. Uh, stuff is sent out, so I am as ready as I'll ever be for dungeon. Awesome. To the vault! To the vault. Come on, game. Ping. Ping! Ping! Patience. Is nah. Tanks don't have patience. Especially a confident tank who knows what they're doing. Okay, that definitely is not me. <laughs> you're fine, you're on Gunbreaker. All is well. Yeah, I still don't like the vault. The vault? Nobody likes the vault. It's one of the worst instances in this X-Pack. Uh -oh. And I Listen. stand by that. Oh, hi, cat. Hello, cat. Oh my gosh. What do we need to hey listen for? It's the Navi. It is always Yay! Navi. Oh, good. This is gonna end poorly. Yes, it is. Cat, have you been into the vault? I don't know if you've been into the vault. Oh, wow. Hi, lag. Instantly walk into the holiest place at the Holy Sea. Catch fire. <laughs> this place sucks. This place does suck. Like... I love Heaven's Word, but this place is just shit. It's also a very big cathedral. It very much is. Why did that not send? Oh, hey, that would be useful. Ah, ad break. Fuck. Charge! Oh, fuck. Oh. Oh, oh. oh, are you kidding me? The door is closed. I can't go through it. Yep. God damn it. I want to pull everything. Everything. <laughs> I am dying. I should probably use my cooldowns. I mean, again, this place is shit. I hate this area. Open the door! Open the door! <laughs> I hate oh my god, they've even it. shut that door. <laughs> what? They've gated everything. The, yes, they have. Wankers. I've heard rants about this. Fucking wankers. I have heard a lot of rants about this shit. Uh, so, I watched uh, the Tom Hardy film Legend recently, where he portrays oh. the two Kray twins. So, I may call people wankers a lot, because I thought it was a great film. I mean... And requires calling a lot of people wankers. Oh, wow, that, yep. that Black Mage is just going for it, huh? Yeah, just fucking hold on, Black Mage. I'm coming. Just, just... Whoops. This is going well. Hi, cat. So we're in the shittiest instance on the planet. Yeah, and I'm dying. 
Come I here, really Vault don't. Deacon. I I love Heaven's Ward. I hate the Vault. Yeah, see, I don't really like Heaven's Ward. <gasps> Controversial. Well, I don't. I can't speak to the others deeply yet either. <laughs> but I do like Heaven's Ward for what it was, and for the time. You know, it was it was a lot better. We have to admit, it was a lot better than the main storyline. What? Which which main storyline? The the of the original game, the base. Oh, what one point oh? Yeah. Uh, well, I mean, yeah. I have a pet. I have a pet log on my windowsill that has is more engaging than the one point storyline. Ah, I see. Yes, the Navi. That makes sense. Also, there's the asshole. Hello, good sir. Now the fight begins. Oh, wow. People are going ham on his ass. Get the fuck wow. back here, you prick. Stop bouncing around! Don't stand near anyone. Don't stand near the white oh, balls anyway. Oh, 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 Don't be by the white balls! Yeah! <laughs> death. death happened. I hate this place. Uh, this is why I hate this place. It is white. I don't see white very well. Uh oh. Let's try this again. He can't use the limit break. That's illegal. But is it though? No, but it should be. Holiest of the holy. Bright light! <laughs> but how are you doing, Cat? How are how's the family and how's work and how's all the mundanities of life? I I hope you're doing better off than I am. Well, way to bring the stream down, only <laughs> seven minutes in. No, I'm just roadkill, and we all know it right now. I'm just like, ah. Uh... Also, we're in the vault. And yes, I'm salty about this. Wait, did I sprint on ahead? Oh, no. Okay, they are here. I'm right behind you. Yeah. I don't care about you. I care about the healer. Oh, for fr No! Okay, seriously, healer. Healer! Um. I'm a little worried about your health. <laughs> Me too, but I think I'm okay. And I think it was my fault because Alina sighted the healer. We're good now. I, I would have used Super Boli, but I don't think they'd have been happy with me. <laughs> That's the thing that takes your health down to 1%, right? Uh, no, it takes my health down to 1. Oh. Hey, Frost. Yeah, I totally get that. It's... We're, we're all kind of in the middle of switching jobs right now, I think. Yay, I fucked things up. Also, hey, Frost. You know what? I love Planet Fitness. I used to have a, uh, uh, subscription with them. What is this? What loot do we have? Yeah. Oh, yeah, Inner Sanctum area. Uh, I forgot about this. <clears throat> At least this part isn't gated too heavily. Yeah, it should be. Yeah. Um. Where the hell was the healer? 
right next to me, standing there faffing about. I like life. I I'm like coming, life. I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming. I got him, I got him. Stop running! If you have hate, stop running, otherwise I can't pick it back up. I couldn't see where you were in relation to me. I will come to you. I can't see shit in this dungeon. I swear to god if I get blamed for that. I had cooldowns up. Nobody's gonna blame you for that. I don't give a fuck if they do. I will argue. I'm in an argutive mood. Argutive? Argu Argumentative Argument. mood. Fuck yeah. it. I don't give a shit anymore. <laughs> Today was the first time in over a week I didn't have to do overtime. Cat, I would love to go tanning. I'm not allowed to go tanning, but I would love to go tanning. If I went tanning, I would spontaneously combust. Yeah, you're not really good with tanning, are you? No, I go from uh, pale as fuck to um, sunburn. Like, there's no in between. The curse of the ginger. <laughs> Could be worse. Oh, he's made a goddamn ball behind me. Reprisal. Yeah, you just keep spouting lobster. your nonsense. Yeah, that's essentially what happens. I go from whiter than snow to lobster. Yeah, I do that. Yes, that would be a hell no from Crush. Why is there a purple thing on me? Uh, don't stand next to the ball. Ugh. Um, okay. I forgot this guy just loves his AoEs. Arms length! Not gonna move me, dickhead. <laughs> oh, okay, there we go, he's dead. Let us through! Let me through! Let me in! Oh, I leveled. 61! Thank you. Yay! Still not going to save me from the hellhole that is this place. No. There's so much line of sight shit. You know what this place reminds me of? Is uh... the... The cathedrals in, um, in WoW. Yeah, fucking I was going to say wow. that. Fucking hell. There's the Scarlet, all the monasteries and shit. I fucked it, those places. You mean the, the place that ends up becoming the Paladin headquarters for, like, Legion or whatever? Something like that, yeah. As if we didn't have enough traumatic experiences of that place. They were like, ha the Paladins are moving in! Oh... I'm still on the fence about whether or not I allow Blizzard to hurt me more by subscribing for the new expansion. You know you're going to. I you am know... going to, it's just when. Because finances are tight this month because of uh, me realising that uh, God of War comes out in two days. Oh yeah. Uh, I will not be streaming it because I want to absolutely binge that game. No, oh, no, I, I agree. Fuck priests! Die. I'm actually going to be doing the same thing, so... <laughs> I'm only going to be playing it 90% for Christopher Judge just going, boy. I I have high, high hopes. Healer, please! The healer is... I feel like I could be more competent than this. The I, healer I mean... is toying with me. There are times when I'll be sitting back there and the healer's just standing there watching your health go down and it's like, what are you doing? Come on, just let them come to me. Just let them come to me. There we go. Frost, you and a burning ball of gas don't mix. Ever. 
You're like I me. Mean, we... The hint is uh, the hint is in the name, Eternal Frost. There. Mm -hmm. Time for a long ass cutscene. I hope the other two don't mind. Because I ain't skipping it. Nope. We gotta keep it. Gotta keep the storyline. Also. Uh... Hey, it's disgust me, boy. Ah. <laughs> That's like ninety percent of what he says. It's like you disgust me. Drinking game made out of disgust me. Oh, okay. The cutscene's after. Never mind. Oh, good. Charibat! Oh God, here we go. Filthy rats! I'll cut you to pieces. And all that. Cheers. Yeah, I don't want to be in that. No. Nope. They're gone with you. They're gone with you, mate. Fuck off. Fucking yeet you off the tower. Oh my god. I don't uh, want to be stood here. No, come back. I'm not done killing you. Ow. Is this the ball phase? This is the ball phase. It is, yes. Give me the balls! Balls! Must go down faster. Oh, I don't have continuation yet. Fuck. I get out of range of my ass. Yeah. Why is everything targeting me? Must die, must die. Please die faster. Thank you. Yes, we had loads of time. I I remember those not going down in bed. We have a black mage that for some reason has insane DPS, so I think we're yeah, all right. I I presume they're in like end game gear. I don't know, let's uh let's creep on them. Uh no, level seventy shit. Oh. Oh god! Oh my frick! Why can't I fucking hit him? There we go. I don't like things. Ah! Okay, what the hell? Oh, there we go. I was targeting the wrong fucking thing, that's why. Burst strike, go! And every other fucking. Squall move that he does with a gunblade. Sickness, Sickness must be purged, my ass. Please die. Please die. He died! He's down. Wow. He's not dead, dead. No. But he is out of our hair. Hey, Destroyer of Butts. Hey, Destroyer of Butts, how you doing? Toll of the Bells, Orchestrion. Yeah. Music. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. What are we doing? Uh oh. I felt I had to. You're, you're okay. Harley Quinning it, are you? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Yes, everybody does know you, Squishy. In fact, I got confused at first with the names on that. I was like, why are you Zephyrin, being called? you're next, you prick. Sorry. Every <laughs> time I see one of the Knights 12, I'm just like, oh, I'm coming for you. Mm -hmm. I don't blame you. 
but we're out of the hellhole. I'm happy about this. Thought oh, yes. Super serious cutscene incoming. What kind of characters are you playing as? Um, looks I'm a bard. A so, naturally, as you would imagine, a bard, they use bow and arrow. Uh, as they do. Uh, I'm playing as a gunbreaker. So I get a gun blade. Yep. I gotta say, uh, at least Final Fantasy XI bard was closer to what a bard probably should be, but... <laughs> Wait, huh, 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 huh. Yeah. yeah, that was really closer to one, but actually, I suppose it is. <laughs> Jesus Christ, Justinian, wash your fucking armor. He's got to be in blood for the rest of his, for the whole rest of the game. Yeah, I'm with Amrick. <laughs> Only because he's awesome. And tear down the very pillars of our society. He's the only decent character in this cutscene. Values, everything we have built over a thousand years. <sighs> a fool to the last. Yeah, pipe down, you old fart. Why don't they just burst the balloon? Because that would make sense. It's a shining arrow. And yeah, so yeet. in Final Fantasy XI, yeah, you, you did a lot of song rotations, uh, but in this game, it's more bow and arrow rotations. And uh, your weapon was primarily your instrument, really. Uh, in 11. So, different songs gave different instrument buffs and result vice versa. So it way, really... to, way to ruin the moment, Sourkush. <laughs> that was, uh, that was the best way to fuck up that cutscene ever, and I approve. This was a serious moment. When I first played this, I was genuinely upset that he died. I'm more jaded now. Yeah, I was about to say. Then other shit goes down. Oh, yeah. No, the whole last x pack that's just happened has left me just completely emotionally jaded to everything else in this game now. I wonder how they're going to top that stuff, honestly. What the fuck? I was trying oh, to... Oh. What? I was trying to find one. <laughs> Find the hello, motherfucker. Yeah, I don't have that one. Surely add that one. Holy shit. Well, thank you for the bits, and now you know what I must do. Yeah, after the cutscene. Oh no, wait, we weren't carrying, were we? Or were we? Were we? Not, not, not during these cutscenes. Oh, okay. Just when I get to play 17, those bitties. Oh, you gotta shake those bitties. Every time you shake those bitties. Come on. Thank you for shaking all the bitties. Let's shake bitties. Let's shake those bitties. Let's shake, 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 shake all the bitties. Let's shake bitties. Thank you guys so much for shaking all the bitties. Let's shake bitties. Let's shake them, shake them, let's shake them, shake them. Let's shake all the bitties. Let's shake bitties. I love you guys. Thank you guys for shaking. Come here and shake bitties. Oh, no. <laughs> so now that we have fucked up that cutscene so royally that there's no redeeming it. Why do the cutscenes keep taking my fucking sunglasses off? Have I got it on an option somewhere that it hides helmets during cutscenes? I have no idea. If I do, I'm going to be so annoyed that that's on. Can everyone just stop whining about the dead guy? Oh, there's a Stinian who's just like, oh, give a fuck, I'm in my dragon bloodstained armor. Oh, fucking. <laughs> I'm, I'm doing okay. Sorry, Kush. I'm just, uh, just here, basically. I've, I've been living in the days of work and. That's gonna be a life. character, isn't it? So I'm just here. That's why we're playing 14 today, because 
I didn't want to think. I mean, when are you going to start? I mean, you know, maybe next year, maybe. I kid, honestly. <laughs> I know you kid. Seriously, it's got to be in here. Some fucking hide helmet in cutscene bollocks. <laughs> right, stop ruining this for me, game. Yep, I mean that that has been the rotation basically. Work, sleep, and also take care of family members. That's been uh that's been my life for the past since well, fine. Thursday. To Mana House for Tom. Oh, House for Tom. House the P, the P is somewhere. I was about to say house pains in the ass. I don't it's our home away from home away from home. <laughs> Are we going to get more complaining about the dead dude? Probably. Because it's not a Final Fantasy game without more mourning. No, on it's top the of evening. I mean, thank you, Rush. That is That is the kind of day we're having. Crush is uh, particularly crushy today. <laughs> and I am just sitting here going, Soda! Busy beverage. Me it's too. all gone. Please. Oh my god, that's freezing. This to serve, to protect, to sacrifice. <laughs> How to give yourself brain freeze. Drink incredibly cold soda out of the freezer. Holy crap. I would do it. We did the one time, and we about, like, keeled over, because it was freezing. And we chugged it. We don't need alcohol to have a good time. We get enough trouble with soda. Are we supposed to be like... Oh, congrats. Oh, nice. A sports company factory? Fuck yes. <clears throat> yeah, it seems like everybody is switching jobs recently. Everybody I talk to, they're either on the hunt for a new one or they've already switched. Alfino. Hello, sir. We get to go talk to Himrek! Yay! Hey, Himrek, I know you're sad, but yay! Uh, Forgotten Knight. Mm hmm. It's Firm Albert. I really hope there's a guy somewhere called Soft Albert. Ever. What? Well, if it's Soft Albert, you know what else we need, right? Prince Albert? Oh, I don't know if many people are going to know what that is. Probably not. <laughs> But that wasn't the one I was thinking of. I was thinking about a very American in-joke. My friend, I am in your debt. Think nothing of it. The wounds are healing well, I trust. Right. I need to be able to have my freedom to work, like, as I want to, and have my music playing and shit. I can't concentrate without that kind of stuff. <laughs> the founding. 
the scriptures a thousand years of all to the common man. I think that's true for all of us, Frost, who know what Crush meant by that. For the blood of the night twelve. I know someone who had <laughs> one. You knew this to be true. Oh what oh oh Well then. I have to pick a choice. The architects of Ishgard, King <coughs> and his knights, <coughs> entrapped and butchered the great worm. I mean, Frost, it's probably not that bad. It's not wise, but it probably isn't bad. Upon learning of their treachery, Nidhogg was consumed with a murderous and justified rage. I dare say you know what followed. I very nearly got um, the king and kicked out of a party in one of the alliance raids once for something I said. Now um, I'm afraid to ask. So someone thought they would be funny and started talking about how they thought it was stupid that people that people were banning revenge porn and stuff. Tried to basically gross people out and all that. And it, it was kind of getting worse and worse to the point where I basically just said, yeah, it's a shame they stopped glass bottom boating as well. No one knew what it was, so they Googled it. Oh my god. PSA for anyone that watches this that doesn't know what it is. Do not Google glass bottom boating. No. If you wow. don't know what it is, you're too, you're, you're correctly sheltered, or you're too young. <laughs> or you're just somebody who simply doesn't Google things on the Sounds internet. Wild. <laughs> now you see, back in the day, I did Google that. <laughs> yeah, so did I, and regretted everything. Yeah, there are there are things I cannot unsee. <sighs> I ask you, my son. Mm-hmm. Well, it's okay. I remember when the Human Centipede came out, and we all watched that. Like that crazy people. I have never seen, and I refuse to. Yeah, well, I didn't know what it was. What do you, mean? you want to talk about a horrible horror movie that never should have been made? To me, that that movie almost crosses the line where it's like, if more shit like that comes out, censorship is almost acceptable. Then they made a second one. And then a third, I believe, because they did the, the final turn. Oh. Unless that's just the definitive edition of the first one, but oh my god. Oh. I mean, yeah, the, the internet has some problems. There's some problems with this. As a collective internet community. No reparations shall ever suffice. This fact alone should serve as ample justification for our actions. Yet some choose to see men like you I mean learn to commit themselves to a nobler cause. A more compelling narrative is required. I mean I think the internet is the collective problem of the internet. When when you when when the internet collectively takes a a chatbot and breaks it to the point that they have to ta re restart the chatbot because the internet broke it so badly that it was becoming a horrible AI, that's when you know we have problems. Poor clever bot. I can't believe they had to restart Cleverbot because of the shit that, that the early 2000s internet fed it. <laughs> I liked it when I think it was Facebook put two AIs talking to each other and they ended up achieving some sort of basic sentient sentiment, uh, sentience and came up with their own language to talk to each other so they had to turn it off. Yeah. 
that's the power of AI, and that's why we must be careful. Oh my God, do I have to do that again? I like how this was a really serious conversation that we're watching, and we're just talking about awful internet things over the top of it. Soon I shall free us from the sins of antiquity. And we are bad people, I guess. I don't know. Listen! Oh god. Hello, Navi. If he has spoken with others, I will have their names. Escort him to a cell and question him. Tell them. Your Eminence. something did you miss a vision of the past uh oh so this is the power of the echo would that it had shown you a finer moment from my past twas an exercise in futility as you saw faced with the firmity of his conviction and his many ready rejoinders my words deserted me <coughs> frank i am embarrassed <coughs> to <report. laughs> I love how everyone's all sort of nonchalant, like, oh, you saw you saw one of my memories and all that. If someone walked up to me and was just like, oh, shit, headache, oh, hey, I've just seen a memory from your past, I'd be like, delete that shit. Yeah, that's not something that I would want people to partake in, no. I cannot help but wonder what manner of change he intends to bring about. I have given some thought to that as well. During the battle within the vault, the Heaven's Ward demonstrated strange and unnatural abilities. Yeah, so... I can't believe that you were given a new name, but I do love that that happened. What does even... where does Squishy even hail from anyway? Like, what, what prompted that? Seven hells. If Lady Iceheart can use her own body as a vessel for summoning, I see no reason why others could not. Are the Heaven's Ward truly so reckless? <coughs> yes. Yes, they are. As they fled, my father spoke of Azis Lark. Though I know not what he intends, I fear... Yes, I have, in fact, seen that movie. His ambitions are too great, and his minions too powerful. <laughs> we must find the Heaven's Ward and stop my father before it is too late. And to be fair, that movie and sequel aren't that awful. I, I, I do like a lot of animated movies, to be honest. See, I saw Finding Nemo, and the utter fucking killjoy that I am, I happen to know about Clownfish, and it, it kind of put it kind of put a sour on the on the movie right from the get go. Oh right, yeah, I know what you're talking about. Because it wasn't factually correct. I'm ignoring mm -hmm. the fact that they were fucking talking in English. That I could let slide. Not, not the anatomy of a clownfish. I will have Sir Zephyr's heart for what he did to Orshafont. I am going to take his head, rip it off, shove his head up his own ass, and do many other things with it that I can't think of right now. I mean...
Although I don't know why I went why. No, I need the heart. What can I do with the heart? Something I can't say on stream. <laughs> Do heartless things with the heart. I'll tell if I remember. I'll tell you later what I was thinking with it. Mm. Suffice to say, it would tarnish what little reputation I have on on Twitch. I have not been paying attention to this cutscene. <laughs> <laughs> More bits! Yeah! Oh, oh no, oh no. More bitty song! More bitty song. More bitty song. Shake those bitties. Oh, you gotta shake those bitties. Every time you shake those bitties. Come on. Thank you for shaking all the bitties. Let's shake bitties. Let's shake those bitties. Let's shake, 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 shake all the bitties. Let's shake bitties. Thank you guys so much for shaking. All the bitties that shake bitties, let's shake them, shake them, let's shake them, shake them, let's shake all the bitties that shake bitties. I love you guys, thank you guys for so Come here and shake bitties. But yes, thank you for the bits. Gotta love the bits and the bitty song. And ooh. I spy a green doohickey. A quest handling? Is that what you mean? No. Oh. A spinny thing. What? Where are you? I'm in our next destination. Oh. I don't want to spoil it. Wait, I've completely walked past Sid. Sid! I need your airship. I haven't come to see you. I'm sure you're doing fine, but I need all your resources. Yeah, how long does it take to do a name change? Like, how long do you have to wait in between them? Wow, thanks for all the bits. Holy shit. Oh my god. What is that? Destroyer bots, what? Oh my god. Here, I just... I will... Okay, you're gonna... <laughs> you're... Yeah, I'll... We're gonna we're gonna we're gonna spam some music here. Start with crab rays. <laughs>
I gotta say, I do like Firefox better for Twitch. And this is I, coming. I, it doesn't even make any here. sense because it's the same architecture. It's the exact fucking same platform, just with a different mm -hmm. fucking name. Uh oh. 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 Oh goodness. Well, thank you, thank you for the sub. Uh oh, wow! Gift sub to Anima. Anima now has a sub. Wow. Way to, to show that Anima's been lurking this whole time and hasn't said anything. Wow. Yes, thank shit. Now you're now you're 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 being very generous. I am I am I am gonna sit here and just be somewhat broken because wow you're being super generous today and thank you. <laughs> Is, is Anima in the chat? Is he lurking? Doesn't he have to be in the chat in order to get gifted? I don't know. Yeah, I don't really know how the chats work either. It's only like we've been streaming for like a year. you think we would know this stuff. I I have I have no idea. I am incompetent as fuck. People don't come here for competence. Because if they want competence, I am not it. It's me. I'm the competent one. Usually you are the competent one because you fix things when I break them. <laughs> oh, okay, if they're followers. Oh, he might not be around then. Mm. To the ah. Enterprise! Yeah, I love Star Wars. And to the very shitty zone that you're coming to. <laughs> I'm waiting for someone to be annoyed at what I just said. I'm not going to be. I'm proud of you for that. <laughs> Oh yeah, we get to fight a giant sky beluga. Yes, we do. <clears throat> we also get to navigate this very crappy place. That's ah, fine. You don't have to navigate shit. I'm the one with the two-person chocobo. Yes, and the reason for that is why? <laughs> because you will get us lost. Mm -hmm. That would be why. Yeah, I mean that's a that's a kind of a nice feature. Um I didn't know that that was possible. Before I pick up the next quest, give me the ghost ship. <clears throat> give me the I already looked. Fucking ghost it's ship. No! I want the ghost ship. Come on, I never get to see the fucking thing anymore. I'm upset now. It will find it eventually. Fucking better. Uh, uh oh. Fine. What do you want, Alpha? No. Ah, uh, what game to play? Shit, I, I have no idea. I suggest God of War, but it isn't out yet. Oh, that's what you meant by the green thing. Mm-hmm. Well, I better pick it up. Rub it all over me. Oh, yeah. It puts the lotion on the skin. Or it gets the hose. Give me the ghost ship. <laughs> Come on. Make it worth being in this godforsaken zone. It's not going to give us a ghost ship because that would be too easy. Uh-oh. Um... Well, bye then. No, nope, come back. I was uh, having a problem with a certain adventurer plate. Again. Yes. What are we supposed to do? Oh, slash lookout. Oh, good. I see nothing but clouds. Nope. Wow, it didn't do anything. Was I too far off? Do 
You search the skies for the Salil, but find nothing. Cool. Waste of my fucking time. Me and the lookout are having a disagreement. Can I just, uh, like, spot a kick alpha now off the edge? I mean, it, that'd be funny, wouldn't, wouldn't it? Wouldn't that be nice? Not to kill him, just as a practical joke, you know. I oh, mean... You're not... <laughs> no, I'm not, because, again, Tillions suck. Oh, yeah, shit. Don't use it, then. Make it soda. <laughs> this looks like a solo duty. It does. It is. <sighs> oh, goody. Well, I guess I'll see you on the other side. Yep. Yes, there's nothing over there, Alpha Man. We can kind of see that. Uh, this ought to be good. I am, uh, I'm expecting everything to go wrong. Guardians. We're not ish guardians. <laughs> that was perfect timing. Oh yeah, Alpha now, you've got a book. Oh, that's gonna be so menacing. I mean he is a scholar. Which should maybe imply the problems with Altino. You know, I feel like they've actually streamed the storyline for this Heaven's Ward because I'm sure we've missed stuff. I feel like that too, but I just figured that we weren't going there yet. It's a fun ship. It is. Hey, unarmed Vanu Vanu, do you maybe want to help us? Oh, it's, it's actually hurting a bit. Hello. Hello yeah, I'm alright. Yeah, I'm not a tank. And Alphino is just like trying to stand in every bit of fire possible, which isn't That's helping. what Alphino does. Like, I, I feel like he's purposefully stood in two AoEs at this point that he didn't need to stand in. Yes, it could. It, it, it's a big, mean... Nonsense. Ship. But the ship is now down. Ship is dead. Now it's just ads. Plenty of ads. Yeah, you guardians ain't shit. Kind of makes you wonder how they managed to evade in the first place. Yeah. The left, you know, you go for a fall.
Okay. No worries, Thanks, Lord third man. I hear the front door. Hmm. I think that was maybe just somebody getting the mail, but we will find out if I get summoned. Uh-oh. Chocobo is spazzing. Oh, right, we're at the top there. Yep. Coming through, Mr. Wamoras. Okay, I am, in fact, so one minute. It's fine. I'm just going to keep wandering aimlessly looking for that goddamn ghost ship. Ooh, wait for going. Great now if we uh, get a good view from Nook's webcam of just some like murderer with a chainsaw just coming into the room. I'm not sure why that would be great, but I would be entertained by that. Or just a hand reaching out of the aircon vent, or just something like weirdly paranormal, because it's, it's like the perfect setup for something like that to happen. Or a jump scare, but we're not that well organized between the two of us to be able to do that. Oh, let's reach into the endless void behind me and grab another soda. It's in there somewhere. could just go on a murdering spree. See how much of this shit I can get. Like AoE onto... Uh... Come on, do AoEs. Yes. Yes. Ha <laughs> ha, poisoned. Hide the evidence! Hide the evidence! I can hear you. No! Why am I poisoned? No! No, you can't see this. Nothing has happened. Nothing at all was decided in your absence. What did you do? Nothing. Don't even read the chat. He likes the nookie. I was saying at this point I would be a sort of like it would be hilarious. I thought it would be hilarious if while you were gone some like the, the door opened and like a, a murderer with a chainsaw came in or something. Apparently that's not funny. So I mean <laughs> And then I will not lie, I tried to get you killed with AoEs but it didn't work. I I see. Except, uh, if you would have done that, we would have been in trouble. <laughs> nah, we'd have been fine. Well, there's no aetherite that we've picked up yet. Well, I got a great view of the whole sea, and there's no fucking ghost ship in sight. Nope, not yet. Dickheads, come on. <laughs> there it is! There it is! Oh my god! Finally! <laughs> Get Yay. 
I can get closer. Okay, believe me, if I could, I would jump off the sea of clouds. Mm hmm. No, it's getting away from us. No! Eh. Back, it's probably one of the few times we'll ever see it. Yay! Finally got you, you fucker. Hello, ghost ship. Hey, I, uh... Athena. Oh, hey, Athena. How you doing? I'm happy now. I got to see the ghost ship. I feel accomplished, actually. Summoning stone! Mm-hmm. Wait, where the fuck does it connect to cloud top? Mm-hmm. Oh, I guess it flies. It kind of needs to, because that other side isn't connected. No, it isn't. It's... Uh... Behold, Oksundu! The place where I store my crap! Yes, the Hobo Minecraft Challenge. I'm, I'm curious about this. More bits. Hmm? Thanks for all of the bits. Thank you, Frost. Very much appreciated. I have my mouth full of food. This was not the time to uh, <clears throat> toss bits. Somehow I feel like that was intentional. But thank you, Frost. Oh my gosh. So, I didn't eat dinner, which is why I'm cramming myself full of donuts because life happened. I do have some of the rules, but didn't you die again? in my absence? Hmm. <coughs> I feel like there was another death. Maybe I'm wrong. But I feel like rules should have reset in my absence, but maybe not. That's a fancy looking Aether, right? It really is. It's, like I'm like a, it's got a weird straw hat on it. <laughs> it's a happy Aether, right? I'm gonna lick it. The tuning. Ah, uh, yeah. I tuned to the Aetherite. Good. Is my ghost ship still there? Or has it fucked off beneath the clouds? Oh, I think it's gone. Oh, well. Yeah, I don't think it stays that long. I mean, if we did any of the 24-man raids, we'd go into it. Yeah. Oh, he's the horniest of them all. <laughs> Even more difficult with friends. That would be terrifying. Especially if you included somebody who doesn't know what they're doing in Minecraft, like myself, that would be also horrifying.
<laughs> yeah. A lot of people have been asking you to do a multiplayer world. Also, what do these asshole bird people want? Yeti people, or Yeti monsters. Uh, they want us to deal with their Sky Beluga problem. Oh yes, the Sky Beluga. Do I have to? It's like one of the best primal fights. It really is. Which is why I don't sound nearly as put off by the idea. Purely because the uh, the music for it is like proper drum and bass. And it's great. Yep, it's good. Because normally it, I fucking hate drum and bass. It's a... No, but it's got a good beat to it. And it also, the vibe is ridiculous. The fight is ridiculous. The platform is ridiculous. People mm -hmm. will see. Quest complete. But yeah, you're right. We shouldn't beat the Sky Beluga yet. Like, not in my head, anyway. Because I'm sure there was a point where we do a war game with the other nations that was earlier on. Yep. Did they remove that whole thing? If they did, that's one long ass uh, removal. Maybe I'm crazy and misremembering. I don't know. I'm sure we got out of Ishgard really quick, though. We did. Really quick. Faster then, than... Then got into good favors with the... Uh, uh, with the, with the city-states again. Yeah, I'm... Mm, I think a lot of stuff got cut. Uh-oh. Oh, no! What? Nothing. Uh-oh. Did your controller disconnect again? Maybe. Nope, they're good. I discovered it in Aetherite Current in my Havoc, though. You mean the one that I just picked up? Yep. Ooh, I detect one approximately 422 y yams to the north mm. east or west was that? Northeast. That'll be mm. over yonder somewhere. Okay. We'll get there. Where oh. Yay. Bored my fluffy butt. <laughs> For everybody who doesn't know, we have affectionately nicknamed the Chocobo Fluffle Butt. Would have been funnier if we just hadn't explained it. Do you really want people thinking you have a fluffy butt? I might. I mean, you don't know. You've never seen it. I... <laughs> Thank you for more bits. <laughs> Thank you for more bits. Thank you so much for more bits. I'm glad you find us that entertaining. I don't know what that says about us as human beings, but thank you. He just wants to see my fluffy butt. That's what it is. I don't have a fluffy butt. <laughs> oh no. Or do I? Quite, yeah. We'll never know. Because uh, according to this webcam, I don't exist below this point, so... 
I mean. No, the only thing fluffly in here is my sprig and hat. <laughs> okay, now that crash effectively broke me, let me bow to the fat bird thing. Wait, is it it? Yep, yep, the sprig and hat is in here. Oh god, is it? Yeah. Oh. Mm. I mean, Jordan has the fluffiest tail. Look at my nice fluffy tail. Uh, we can't because I'm in a cutscene where we can only see my fluffy tail. Actually, we can't even see that because it was hidden by our webcams. No! That's exactly how it works. Oh god, now I have hiccups. <laughs> Apologies, everybody. I mean... Maybe. Could you imagine if, like, nothing existed outside of the realms of our little box? We'd go crazy. I mean, since I have my background turned off, basically, I just exist in, like, <laughs> some weird pocket dimension. That'd be great. That would be really great, actually. Oh, look at all these Aetherite quests to pick up. Mm hmm A sea of purple! No one cares about side quests. I just do them for the Aether Current. Mm-hmm. Because we want to be able to fly. So you've got a really busy schedule now, huh, Athena? Is there any other purple I missed? Uh, no, but there is more quests down at the other Aetherite, so if we do these ones first. Oh, okay. There's a talky person nearby too, I think. Welcome back. Oh wait, no, that's the that's the main quest. No, we don't want to do that yet. 
Oh, Fuck right, that okay. guy. Actually, he's probably going to take us off out there anyway, so yeah, we probably should talk to him. What do you want? May we help you, big bird, sir? Hmm. Aha, I was right. Huh. <laughs> nice. My chocobo is so fucking slow. Sadly, they're going to be until after we get all the currents. But I still say it makes the chocobo weird to run so slow. Yeah. Um. I don't have a quest for here. What happened? Did you not pick it up? Oh, did I actually have to pick up the one that wasn't uh, purple? No, that was the purple one. I don't have a purple one. Did you just do Nutritious and Delicious? Because I didn't pick that one up. I'll go get it. I have no idea where any of this is. Uh, Javanian? Mm, Flying the Nest, I think the quest is called. Hmm. I'll catch you up on my tactical spriggan. I, uh... I do have that one. But I've got a red... red circle here. Oh, you haven't spoken to everybody. Ah. Oh, yes. Here's, here's this guy. Hello. There we go. Now I have to, with chat mode, enter the phrase, wake up to jackass. Okay. Yep, now he's all the way over there. Okay. Tactical Spriggan. Hello, Tactical Spriggan. Happiest little Spriggan. Look at his fucking face when I jump. <laughs> <coughs> that Spriggan is great. Fucking adorable. Very happy Spriggan. Whoops. I pissed things off. Yay. I scared them away. No, you have to have a capital W and the exclamation mark. Oh, for God's sake. There we go. Alrighty, there we go. Get onto the bird. Get onto the bird. Target not in range? What do you mean it's not in range? There we go. It means it wasn't in range. Yeah, I mean, uh, when it comes to growing viewership, I, um, uh, 
I find that just being in multiple discords is the best. I, I haven't found any luck on Facebook, personally. And uh, I don't find a whole lot of luck on uh, on Twitter either, personally. Just hanging around in communities other than our own is really for the best. Kern is still rubbing himself with the green nonsense. After he finishes rubbing himself with green, let's go do the sleep bliss at Nox Undo first. Oh yeah, okay. He hmm. may well send us round here, but meh. Hmm. So your chocobo just booted me. Hit just hot. That's fine because I see a doohickey. Don't hand that in. Okay, well, it knocked me off, so. Won't, I won't hand that in. I will ride pillion. I don't know why it kicked me off. Uh the hell? Choke of a why? Hmm. Now it's not letting me on at all. Then we walk. Bad chocobo. That chocobo did not like me today. I've never seen that happen before. Let me on. Don't you dare, Chocobo. I'm watching you. I think it just doesn't like the rocks. Possibly. Hmm. Gurgle grass. Hello. I would like some gurgle, gurgle oh, grass. My stomach was doing that all of last night and today. Hmm. Gurgling? Yeah. It's okay. Uh... Me up the mountain. <coughs> there we go. Just because I'm not sure if it brings us around here on the quest or takes us back. I'm going to say right. just having a backtrack. Yeah, backtracking would suck. I wonder if they streamlined Stormblood too. I hope not. Stormblood's great as it is. Where am I going? Right. Up toward here. death. You are headed toward death. Hello, groundskeeper. Go away, groundskeeper. Nobody likes you. Poor groundskeeper. I feel like I have lost the buck here. Oh, yes. Okay. What? I was catching up on chat. I was confused. Now I'm no longer confused. God damn Endymions. Oh. Hello, Endymion. C. 
Sid, my man. <laughs> He's on a happy little. Mm. Okay. Huh. <laughs> Ah, yes, magic. The limitless oh, blue now accessible. Oh, well, here we go. To the limitless blue. Oh, God, here we go. And while we wait, might as well go finish up these quests. Mm hmm. Ah, oh, fuck it, I'm not walking all the way back. No, it's not Zenith. No, it's not. It is definitely not Zenith. Oxundu. I that's that's where I meant. Oh goodness. This is the discussion where Frost shines because I am not well versed enough in a match the gathering these days to uh to keep up with the intricacies of magic. I, I never played it. I never had the right head for it. Mm. I I used to play it quite a bit, but Did you pick up that quest in uh, Ishgard by the way? have to talk with this guy uh yes thank god <laughs> yeah yeah that was the uh that was the quest that we were like oh wait this is for another area and it was it was for here <laughs> Yeah, for me, the reason I don't play Magic anymore is just because it's not a, uh... I used, to, I used to play it fairly competitively, but I was a kid back then, and nowadays I just don't have the, uh, patience to do that. <coughs> I have I have other ways to spend my time these days than, uh, playing Magic, so that's why I stopped, but, uh... I know a lot of people who still play it. When I was a kid... Magic was so popular that my brother was into it, so I have a lot of the old retro cards. Like, from the late 80s. Late 80s, early 90s era. I got a lot of those. I have some stuff from the early 2000s as well. But I don't have any of the more recent decks. Oh, we have to kill a galley kitten. We do. I don't want to kill a galley kitten. They're cute. I mean, the kitten. There's one right over here. Sad. I feel bad for the kitten. Oh, looks like it made a friend. Oh, it didn't Hello. drop a fucking wing either. No, it didn't. We have to kill another one. Ah, oh, fuck. No, I fat fingered my invuln. <laughs> Seriously, still nothing. Oh, God. But yeah, that's what my invulnerability does. Just lol, no health. There it is. Yep. 
We're good. Also, I feel bad when they die. They make yeah, such me too. Time. That's why I'm glad it dropped. Right. The only current we're missing is the one from fighting Sky Beluga. Yes. Which still has not popped yet. It has not got. Look at all this map that we haven't explored. Because we can't. Because we can't fly. Mm-hmm. Because Sky Beluga. Well, I, uh, let's just get back to work Sunday. Aye, aye. If I remember rightly, there's like a moogle shaped island down here. Yes. And that very. Yeah, I do remember there was a. Might be over this way. Or is that on the north side? Don't know. Let's go find it. Ah! Get on the chocobo! No, don't target the baby chocobo. There we go. You can get on the baby chocobo if you want. It won't get far. Ride! <laughs> yeah, well. <laughs> go away, Mura Camper. I think it's it. There it is! No, that's the Heart Island. Damn it! The fuck is the Moogle one? I'm sure there's a Moogle one. Yeah, I'm pretty sure there is, but I wonder if you have to be up on the the where the zone pillars part of the zone is. I wonder if you have to be up there. I think you're right. I think it's on the northern side. To the north! Yay! Okay, now that setup is just brutal, Athena. <laughs> Really taking a while to ping. Mm hmm. At least now we got two ticks. The question is are we going to be able to get healers? Yes. Aha. Uh -huh. That'll do. Oh, uh, I don't think we can see it. I think it's higher than us. Oh, God, really? I think oh. it's that island right in front of us. Mm. Oh. Right, here we go. Time to fight a giant sky whale. Alright, everybody get ready. I bet you... I bet you five gil you fall off the edge. I mean, that's probably going to be a given. Unless they've edited the fight so you can no longer fall off the edge. Oh no, you can I fall off the edge. I have yeeted myself off the edge a few times. Hey, we've got three Dragoons! So we've yep. got two real tanks, three floor tanks. Nice. Well, fine. I'll do it then. Here it comes! And... Island Slam! Bosh! 
Cetacean Rage. <clears throat> Stand by the fill generator, and when I shout to, to use it, use it. Aye, aye. Oh, thanks for the follow. Oh, yes, thank you for the follow. Wait, I swear I pulled that guy. Uh. I guess I didn't. Use it, use it, use it, use it! <laughs> oh, fuck. There we go. Everybody onto his back! You actually have to be on his back for this. Yes, I know. Okay. Come on, get up there. <sighs> come on, come on. Come on. Oh, he wiggling. Let me know if you want round two of the doohickey. Uh, he won't here. Oh, okay. I just hope I don't have to swap with the tank. Well, I don't know if that's in hard mode. I, I, I don't know. Might not be. Oops. Oh my god! Hmm? Oh, the skies are darkening. Yep, yep, they are. And now we don't even have to worry about the generator. Yep. Hi, Bismarck. Oh, God, here we go. Now the good music. Yep. And here's where things start to ramp up and get complicated. I'm right on the edge and I don't want to be. No. Nope. Oh, don't stand near anyone. Nope. I'm nervous. Where is he? Ah. <coughs> Come on. Someone just let me break it and be done with it. Aye aye. Yes. Done. He dead. No, I didn't fall off. Good job I only bet you five gil then, didn't it? I mean... Again though, as a Dragoon, I've yeeted myself off these edges <laughs> more times than I can count. Ow. 
I am very good at eating myself off the edges of this battleground. It's the key to Azizla. It is. It's Allegan. We're about to get the wind crystal back. I think. I would assume it's the wind crystal. Having just fought the wind god. If it wasn't the wind crystal, we would be in a weird spot, gotta admit. It's the wind crystal! Yay! Ding! We are even more complete now than ever before. Oh, we can hear Heidelin again. How do I get off this island? <laughs> Very carefully. So falls the Lord of Mists, as did all others before him. Shut up, Ikiorim. How many times does this mate? Oh yeah, we have to deal with those idiots. Oh, how much he was beyond, far beyond the limits of mere mortals. It's because I'm not a mere mortal. I'm just a mortal. What we seek. Key to Azizla and the secrets of Alan. Yeet it over the edge. Or just get hit in the face by dark magic. I see you have regained the blessing of light. Oh dear. I mean, did we really expect anything less? to you at the end and to you as well warrior of light for saving us the effort of slaying bismarck now that the key is within our grasp the path to the heavens shall at last be laid bare That is a very over-the-top key. I mean... Couldn't just use a fucking door key, could they? Nope. Couldn't they just been like, oh, hey, look, I got the fucking key to Azizla. Yay, no, it has to be some kind of weird... <laughs> <laughs> fucking Alex, no wonder they went extinct. <clears throat> Can we just quit being a little bitch in the background and actually hurt someone? Right, just saying. I mean, again, it wouldn't be special if we did that. Why didn't we just aim a dragon killer at them? Like, as they fly off, like, <laughs> that, I mean, that would fuck that them makes up. Sense. Hmm.
It's Azizla. It is. What new mythical thing will we learn about now? That we're fucked. I mean... Free bird! <sighs> we get the wind-up Sid. We do. However, I just uh, made an unfortunate realization. That cutscene popped me back near the blue window. So? I gotta fly back to the quest key mark. Well, it's gonna take me there too. I don't think it was supposed to do what it's what it did though, because I was in a. Oh no. Ah. Uh. Imperial troops. And they have already secured the area. Oh wait, we have flying now, don't we? Yeah. Okay. Reveal Thank God. Well, my ship just went off the edge, you see, and I didn't think I had it yet. There you are. Except I'm in the same cutscene and gonna be back where you just spawned in because you and skipped all the cutscene. Which means you've flown out there for nothing. Well, you've got to talk to Sid, don't you? I'm talking to him now, I'm in the cutscene. Yeah, it didn't it you no, know, when I got out of the cutscene of the of the fight and loaded in, I wasn't next to Sid. I was I was looking for Sid going, Where the fuck is he? And I realized I was on the other side of the map. Also, thanks for the bits. Yes, thank you for the bits. Mystery of Butts, you are or Squishy, which one would you prefer to be called? You are the true legend today. And I will... I will... I will something... Where's the... Come here. Here we go. Shake those bitties. Oh, you gotta shake those bitties. Every time you shake those bitties. Come on. Thank you for shaking all the bitties. Let's shake bitties. Let's shake those bitties. Let's shake, 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 shake all the bitties. Let's shake bitties. Thank you guys so bitties. much for shaking all the bitties. Let's shake bitties. Let's shake them, shake them, let's shake them, shake them. Let's shake all the bitties. Let's shake bitties. I love you guys. Thank you guys for sure. Come here and shake bitties. See, I take his threats of. It being our last words, more seriously. Stars. If he wasn't wearing that ridiculous hat. <laughs> right. Also, thank you for the stars shout out. Nothing like having Nemesis in Peter's stream. I'm freaking out slightly. And I'm not expecting him. Sir, I could shit diamonds person talking right now. Please be rid of yourself. Go yeet yourself off of the cloud. No, don't. They are not his thralls. Oh, god damn it. Alfie, no. Shut up, regular. Hmm. Take cover. I mean, yeah, the the 
That one character, he looks like he could shit a diamond at any time. Thank you, Destroyer of Butts. You are, you're, again, you're being super generous today. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Let's see here. We shall meet again, warrior of light. <laughs> On that you have my oh, voice. goodness. Hello, Trick Borg. Shake those bitties, oh you gotta shake those bitties Every time you shake those bitties Come on, thank you for shaking all the bitties Let's shake bitties, let's shake those bitties Let's shake, 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 shake all the bitties Let's shake bitties, thank you guys so much for shaking All the bitties, let's shake bitties Let's shake them, shake them, let's shake them Shake them, let's shake all the bitties, let's shake bitties I love you guys, thank you guys for sure Come here and shake bitties Oh, okay, so it did eat you all the way back to BFE. Okay. Yeah. That's so weird. That's so no, it's weird. not. You hand in the quest, it gives you a cutscene, you end up back there, and you've got to come back. But because you skip everything, you didn't well, get I, that. Well, I'm watching it through here, but yeah, I'm I mean, not again, saying that was a bad thing. It's just because you skipped it, you didn't see the, the cutscene transition. That's why you're confused. Well, anyway. Because, yeah, the hand in is up here at Sid. That's so ridiculous. Okay. Uh, oh, risk it. Right. Oh, man. I don't want to Good beef brisket is always good. Alright, well, now I'm going to cut scene with Sid as he's talking at length. Yeah, he does talk at length. <laughs> Are we really going to gloss over the fact that Lucia just piloted one of the mech things? Yes. Okay. Oh my gosh. Oh. 13 hour cook? Holy crap. I don't know, it's going to be super tender. Yeah, we average our brisket anywhere from 10 to 16, depending on the size. Three racks of ribs and two beef, beef ones of pork. Oh my gosh. That has got to be unholy expensive. Like, the prices of meat nowadays. Wow. That would be tasty. Least of all under these circumstances. Well, Athena, it's hard not to be hungry when we're talking about brisket and ribs. My full name is Lucia Go Junior, and I was born a citizen of Garlemalt. Mm. Ah, that explains it. 
first met an Ishgard, I very nearly called you Lydia. Lydia? Lydia Saskin? The tribunus who served under Dias van Beelsa. Aye, she was my sister. Though we spent little time together. <laughs> After our parents were killed in an uprising, we were sent to live in different households. We say that, but apart. now I want brisket. Lydia felt at home on the battlefield and strove to become a soldier, while I underwent training to become a spy. So, which side was... My mission was to leave that Aladdin relic for great work of good in the vault. That could be misconstrued. <laughs> I think that was the point. I'm sure. Though I was given little information at the time, I now suspect I was searching for the fusion kit recently lost. And then I met Sir Enric. It was his usefulness to my mission which prompted me to approach him. But I soon found myself drawn to him for other reasons. He too was a prisoner of his heart. Judged for his heritage as a bastard son of the Archbishop. Yet unlike my sister and I, he did not curse his death. He simply rose above it. In time, I came to realize that I had found a man worth following. And a new home besides. And when I subsequently confessed all to Sir Enric, he was good enough to accept me into his service. I do not question your loyalty to Sir Enric. It is your loyalty to your sister which concerns me. I have long been of the opinion that those who dwell in the past disbelieve in sight of their future. My sister fought for her convictions and for those she held dear. So do I. So must we all. Ooh. Actually, we don't do fudge, we do cookies here. I don't do either. What holiday uh, sweets do you, does your family have? We should be getting close. We don't really. Ah. Once we break through those clouds, we'll be right where the light was pointing. Right where Azizla should be. Hold on, everyone! I mean, we tried to make peanut brittle ones and it was a complete shit show here, so ever since then we haven't uh, done peanut butter, yeah, peanut brittle or fudge. So we mass produce cookies. Peanut butter blossoms, uh, Two kinds of chocolate chip. Something that's usually jelly filled. Some sort of barrier. Beer smoked turkey. Oh my god. Oh my Jesus, now I'm hungry. I've lost the auxiliary propeller. Sid, it's no use. We must return to Ishgard and find another way. There is no other way. Push is this through. The point? Is this the point where like Wedge just flies off into the ether? I don't think he does that. Aw. That would be fun. Yeah, no, he doesn't do that. That'd be fun though. We'll be back, Hazisla. I like turkey, but it has to be done right.
Turkey is very easy to dry out. Oh yeah, prime ribs too expensive, are you kidding? <laughs> that would be pricey. Here we usually do a ham and a turkey. We do both. We just do a turkey. It's the only time of the year we eat turkey is Christmas. Ah. Uh -huh. What about pudding? We have pudding? Tasty puddings? Oh yeah, we have Christmas pudding. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not a monster, come on. You say that, but for the past uh, three years, I have not had Christmas pudding. We always get a Christmas pudding that has an orange in the middle of it, so like when you cook it, it caramelizes the orange. Ooh. That's good. Yeah, I haven't had a proper proper pudding in three years. In summary, the Isle owes its lofty position to the industry of the Alibars. And we can be all but certain that the Archbishop and his cronies are enjoying the view from its top. I see. If we are to join them, we will first need to pass through the Isle's etheric barrier, which is, alas, more And we always do that thing me. where you set I fire to it. The setting on fire of it. That's always good. We set on fire alcohol. Well, yeah, yeah, yeah. We like superheat brandy until it catches fire and then pour it over the Christmas pudding. We don't set fire to the Christmas pudding. <laughs> no, no, I mean, we set fire to our shots before we blow out the fire and take the shot. on your experience, is there no other way that we might breach the barrier? I have had a well, bourbon glaze like you're talking about, though, and that's always quite good. By nullifying them with elemental converters. <sighs> the one we're up against this time dwarfs ores we've encountered before. The Enterprise simply isn't large enough to bear the requisite amount of crystal. Well then, the Empire better fix that. A veritable mountain of crystals that could only be born by lacking two galleons together to form a twin vessel. Yes, I have not seen the Queen channel in Discord. You need to go look at that. That said, we're not without options. If it isn't feasible to nullify the barrier, we might try piercing it. How? We create a ram of condensed ether and mount it on my ship. There's just one problem. I don't have the faintest idea how to build one. It's going to take a true authority in the field, I reckon. Would that the Archon was still with us? But yesterday evening, I chanced to find Mistress Fatali in unusually high spirits. Assuming I understood her excited ramblings correctly, she has acquired a clue, pointing to the whereabouts of one such individual. An Archon? Truly? Ha! Fortune favors the righteous, eh? Well then, let's not waste any time. While you go and look for our missing friend, I'll work on modifying the Enterprise. Her hull will need reinforcement to bear the punishment, not to mention a mount for the ram. Just you wait, my pretty. By the time I'm finished... Ah. Uh, also, candied bacon? Um, never had it really. I've had honey bacon. Do you guys ever just like cook food normally? Like uh, to the point where the rest of the world isn't worried about you guys? America. If it's not slathered in some sort of fat, butter, or something that can kill you, it's not cooked properly.
We are a very weird bunch of people with what we do. Ah, hello, Tataru. There's nothing wrong with boring cooking. <coughs> I dare say a great many boring meals are considered creature comforts. Back to Wulda. Ah, yes. Wulda. For more Pippin nonsense. I mean, my favorite thing to do is what we call a grinder because it's how my dad used to make them. He doesn't grill his hamburgers. He browns them in the pan, or when he was live, he ground them in the pan, uh, made sure that they were like cooked through decently. So they were like not fully cooked through, obviously. Still a lot of pink in the middle. But then he would, after they got a good sear, put them in a layer of, of tomato soup and slice onions and put the ringed onions on top and then finish cooking it in the oven. Oh, I do love a stir fry. Oh yeah, a good stir fry can't beat it. Hello, Pippin, you goofball. Uh, favorite thing in a stir fry? It depends. It depends on the sauce that's going to be used. So, if we're talking about thicker, heavier sauces, I want a, a red meat of some sort. If we're talking about lighter, more delicate sauces, then I want a white meat or a fish or poultry. Of some sort. But that really does depend on the sauce. Vittles. So it's not too spicy. The thing is, a lot of people make stir fry soup or spicy, and I don't care for that. Yeah, you're a general chicken? Yeah, no, Frost, you can keep that. I know that's spicy. I do like some general chicken, though. What is going on in my chat box? <laughs> what do you mean, what's going on in your chat box? Somebody leveled up a shitload. Ah, uh, oh yeah, I see. Yeah. 
I have never used broccoli water, ever. I don't know how that would even taste. No, that's broccoli, water chestnuts, beans, oh. sprouts, and bamboo shoots. I read that as broccoli water chestnuts. I was like, what? <laughs> water chestnuts, yes. Love yes. water chestnuts. So do I. I will just eat them out of the can. <laughs> They're good. Have you ever, and I know this sounds stupid, but have you ever, like, uh, sautéed them and then just laid them over a steak? No. Oh, it's so good. Especially if the steak is, like, cooked not a lot. Very tender. And I, I don't like black and blue steaks often, but with water chestnuts I do. If they're caramelized. It's the only time I want my steak mooing. It's the only way I eat steak. It's got to be blue. Mm. Yeah, but you probably get a lot of good quality steak over there, don't you? Yeah, we have a local butcher's. We go and get some good yeah. steaks from them. Yeah, we don't uh, have a lot of good meat choices in my area. Deep fried lobster mac balls. Ooh. See, I don't like mac and cheese. So. I love mac and cheese homemade mac and cheese it's just being lactose intolerant that does present a problem <laughs> right poor mac and cheese yeah i know i know it's super popular and a lot of people like it i could just never get behind the texture of it What about cauliflower cheese? That sounds terrifying. Have you not had cauliflower cheese? No. You literally get an entire head of cauliflower and just smother it in cheese. Cook it, obviously. Don't need it raw. Ah, so you just mean cauliflower and cheese. Okay, I thought you meant like cauliflower noodles cooked that way. Uh, yeah, I mean, I've, I've had cauliflower with cheese on it. It's okay. I prefer broccoli and cheese better if I'm gonna do one yet, but... The funny thing about me is I actually am a purist when it comes to veggies. Well, yeah, I mean, I... Uh, yeah. Veggies normally as well. It's a treat that we have cauliflower cheese. Ah, uh, yeah, for me, like, I just want my veggies steamed to perfection. Good steamed vegetable, I won't even put butter on it, I'll just eat it. Well, what do you class as steamed to perfection? Where it's cooked enough not to be crunchy. But at the same time, it's not a wilted, dying mess in a corner. See, for me, it's got to have just that little bit of a crunch left. Yeah, I mean, it's got to have some crunch to it, but like, like not raw, right? Oh, and yeah, not, yeah, like... no. And not like you put it in your mouth and it just sort of goes... <laughs> <laughs> right, right. Yeah, I want it to be kind of think of like a noodle, like al dente kind of, like that I want it to be. Yeah, I know steaming vegetables isn't actually good for them, but still. I mean, I'm not a health nut, so I don't care. <laughs> but steaming is the only way I know how to cook Cavallo Nero. I don't know how to cook it any other way, and that shit is good. 
Okay, explain to me what that is. <laughs> I feel like I have lost the buck on that. Let me, let me just Google it. Uh, according to the BBC Good Food, Cavallo Nero is Curly Kale's tall, dark Italian cousin. Ah, yes. Okay, I know what you're talking about. Yes, I guess. Yeah. Okay, so, see, this is where I get in trouble, because I like haggis. Haggis a lot of people is amazing. A lot of people so much. Food of my homeland. But it's got to be cooked right. That's another one where you got to be of really careful. Of course it's got to be cooked right. Otherwise, you get food poisoning. I know this. But haggis is good. Haggis is great when it's cooked well. Oh, nice. In perceiving the world around him, but see, I'm in America, so ask me how many places know how to cook haggis where I live. Uh, I'm going to guess one. Zero. Oh, okay. We actually have to drive up north to get to good ha- So, so, uh, there's a place here in Michigan that is a German and, uh, Polish community way up north. And you can go there and you can get all kinds of great German food. You can also get haggis and a couple of other things. Yeah, so our local uh, supermarket just has haggises that you could just you could buy one frozen or fridged or whatever and then you could just microwave it. Oh, if beautiful. you don't want to go through the traditional route. Right, that makes sense. Seers can commune with them through feelings. Naught that we can impart will serve to aid them in identifying the Shola. No, they must needs be presented with ether which is akin to hers. If we could but find a family member. This has been cooking with Kern and Crush. I mean... Could you imagine us doing a cooking stream? I feel like that would be a terrible idea. Pray, seek this sister out then and bring her to Evershade. There, we shall petition the great ones. We'll probably end up giving someone food poisoning if we did a cooking stream. <laughs> Possibly. Or I'd end up setting my kitchen on fire. I don't know. Recipes from the Final Fantasy XIV cookbook. Where the fuck have I put that? Hold on, I'm going to be disappearing into the background for a second. Yeah. This thing? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> there are some good recipes in here. Oh shit, I do have legs! They're gone now, yeah. you see. They're gone. That's uh, so they disappeared into the ether again. I mean. But notice how, notice how I tactically stayed facing forward so no one could see whether I had a fluffy butt or not. One step ahead of you all. <laughs> oh goodness. It's the crush myth of the fluffy butt. <laughs> <laughs> well, no one I'll ever know. It'll forever be a mystery. Wait, where I'm the much... fuck am I running? Fuck I don't that know. shit. Taking the internet. I'm following you. Uh, I guess Miketos. Oh, we I have went full so. Yeah, well, they're about equidistant. Race you. I mean, I'm an idiot, so you're going to win.
Fluffy husky butt. Hi, Drippers, by the way. Hey, Drippers. Husky butt. Why the... Oh, my goodness. I'm actually kind of glad Ruka's not here to read this chat, or we would end up with somebody with a pillow for a butt as a drawing. Yeah. Do not show her this chat. Oh, you should see some of the doodles I've had to veto. Because as hilarious as they are, they are definitely not appropriate. <laughs> <laughs> there may or may not be an image of two ferrets sitting, and I preface this with sitting on a very particular desk. Please tell me that picture does not exist. Oh, it exists. No! It's it's just, I haven't shared it with anybody. <laughs> that is staying locked in the vault for forever. Share it with me. I don't have to locate it, but sure. It's just, it's just the two little ferrets sitting happily on the desk. Completely innocuous for anyone who doesn't know what that's about. We are not going there. That was last stream. Not doing it now. That was last X pack. It was. Damn it, Gridania, why are you making me run around so much? Hearken to me, O oh great ones. Also. Kind of I respect you, but can you not? I mean, Athena, you you wouldn't be able to get a hold of it. I have the only copy. Of that particular, very particular photo or drawing. More well, than try, but you won't find it. Fact. It is in one of these two flash drives. Not sure which one at the moment. But one of those two. Hello, I we found your stola. We did. I don't know what the price of that would be. Mm, I don't know about that. Mainly because there's still stuff in the works. So I don't know if I want to show that image. There's there's stuff we're working on. <laughs> oh my god, they just bundled her up like a burrito. Like they you did. would actually bundle a cat. That's amazing. And I love it. But yeah, I keep a lot of stuff on flash drives. I don't actually use cloud services all that much. I keep flash drives. A room has been readied at the roost. Pray, spare her thither at once. Okay, there's only two of the 
one, two, three, four, five. Yeah, this is only two of the five I have. I have flash drives everywhere and I fuck knows what's on them half the time. I need to buy another two more, I think. I'll do that during the holiday season. But the two I brought out specifically, those are just for TDF stuff. What, what do you need to get ready for, Athena? Uh, is the stream starting soon for you? I sense, I sense a live stream impending. It's like, uh, Gridania is such a mess. Yeah. <coughs> okay, sounds good, Frost. Shorten the length of the hydrate. Oh, on Athena's channel. <laughs> oh, I jumped too early. Fuck. Yep, I did say thing. Ah, uh, crap. Put me up the hole. There we go. I mean, that is... I don't know why we're running. I'm running. Why are we even going to the Conjurer's Guild? Yeah. yeah. Because Connie Senna's going to be there, or East Samu Yan, or whoever. Bless you. The White Mage is going to be there. <gasps> biddies here. Come on. Shake those biddies. Biddies are here? an NPC called Biddy. Oh, he is. Should I be shaking the biddies for the biddy? No. That would be unfortunate. <laughs> oh my gosh. Pounding another monster is a bad idea. Oh no. Oh no. Crash! You're bad influence. Naturally. Shake those bitties. Oh, you gotta shake those bitties. Every time you shake those bitties. 
bitties, come on. Thank you for shaking all the bitties. Let's shake bitties, let's shake those bitties, let's shake, 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 shake all the bitties, let's shake bitties. Thank you guys so much for shaking all the bitties, let's shake bitties, let's shake them, shake them, let's shake them, shake them, let's shake all the bitties, let's shake bitties. I love you guys, thank you guys for sure. Come here and shake bitties. Good job no one ever tries to talk during that because I can't hear shit when that's going on. I mean... <laughs> I do talk a little bit every now and then, but yeah, it's just too loud. Apparently these two are having a bit of a, a bit of a scuffle. Oh, so they are. Well then. Ah, I'm sure one of them will win at some point. Well then now. Ah, oh, shit. Yeah, you disappeared before I could... Hold on. Stop, 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 stop. Uh-oh. I lost the bet. And I never paid up. Uh-huh. Thank you. Five you. Enjoy the dark side. I already am on the dark side. I mean, that's not... Yeah, that's not difficult. Can we just take a moment to appreciate Tataru's mouth going that big? That was quite impressive. Tataru. <laughs> you are safe, Mikoto. And you look like you're blind now, but yeah. About you after me. I mean, only half the change is with me. I seem to sense the ether around me more keenly than before. I am pleased to see you well again. Do you feel strong enough to talk? Worry not, I am well enough. Get to Taro just creeping at the bottom of the screen there. <laughs> yep. That there had been a ton of rats. Tataru's very happy. That was my doing. I brought the tunnel down that you and Linsidia might escape. At the last moment, I invoked the teleportation magic in hopes of spiriting Banquet away at least. Needless to say, it did not go quite as planned, and I found myself adrift in the life stream. The others? Where are they? Did they not escape? They remain unaccounted for. You were the only one we have been able to find. I am truly sorry. It was the Crystal Braves who pursued you that day. Shut up, Alpha. No. Uh, it's always about me. <laughs> Fucking dweeb. No apologies are necessary, Alpha. No. You are not to blame for what occurred. Know that were our comrades here, they would commend you for keeping the light of hope alive. Don't, don't worry. The others are alive and well, I'm sure of it. We just need to find them. Indeed, Tataru. Let us find our friends and I mean, sure, Tataru. I'll get right on that. Ha, there is the Alpha No I remember. In and all I of in what's happened return, in the story. Time I arose. Where the fuck is Alize? <laughs> Ah, <laughs> that is a very good point. <gasps> that reminds me, <laughs> I have a change of clothes for you. I don't like to boast, but I made them myself. I learned how to weave while we we're in Ishgard, you see. I love that look of get out. 
I mean. <laughs> it's even better with my character. Mm. Like, yeet both of the males out of the room. Brah. Look how happy Tataru is. Do I have to? Can I not just pretend she doesn't exist and she'll go away? Be nice to Tataru. She's just a harmless little Lalafell. Lalafell are not harmless. She is, though. And you want for some manner of etheric ram to pierce the floating isle's protective barrier? Okay, then. Might we be able to furnish us with one? <laughs> That's a thing. A means to prise open a hole in an Alagarn barrier. And one large enough to admit an airship, no less. Hmm. Nay, I lack the knowledge to devise such a weapon. figure in the field of etheric research and one of the finest scholars ever to grace Charlian, Matoya, my former master. Now we're going to Final Fantasy 1. Yep. Because of course we are. Where did the dancing bunny girl go? Well uh, I haven't logged my other character in, so I don't know. No, no, there was a... There's dancing bunny on the table when I got out of the cutscene. What bar are you in? The and one next to you? <laughs> She's no longer on the table, but she was on the table. <laughs> Oh. She's standing here, though. Still existing. Yes, yes, Tola. I agree. We will fix all of this. Alfino, shut up! He's reminiscing about the fact he was born in Chalayan. But yes, he does need to shut up. I really don't want to hear his reminiscing. Wow, reminisce. I must be hungry because I just I just read that quest to speak with Alphano of the Aetherite Pizza in Ishgard. <laughs> I mean, Aetherite Pizza. Why does it always come back? Oh, why is she back on the table? I I I, duh. Damn it! I already left. Yeah, so did I. Time to talk to the Alfino at the eighth rate pizza. Here he is. But I don't see a pizza. I do see a Tataru. You could eat her. You could. Now you're understanding that Lalafels are just cattle to be bred and eaten. How else do you think we make taru kebabs? I mean... Also, why the fuck have we still got the sprout in our head? At what point because does that I thing fuck off? I don't think it does till we hit max level. No, I'm pretty sure it does eventually. I mean, we're level 62 and it hasn't fucked off yet. <laughs>
Hello, Yashtola. Ooh. What tales do you have to tell me? What a shame that we can just fly over to the hinterlands. I mean... That'll be a small favor for sure. Oops. We're just gonna ignore that I did that. Did what? Nothing. Did what? <laughs> what do you think I did? Did you... Look at my adventure plate. Close. Did you look at your own adventure plate? Yes. <laughs> that would be what I did. And now I am examining your gear intently. <laughs> Why? I don't know. Ooh. I like the way the soul looks, though. I want my yellow cube. Yes. Quite nice, as opposed to my cube. It's more of a green splurge, isn't it? Yeah. It looks like a, something had an accident, yes. <laughs> Where to the melted snows of Abelavia's spine eventually find their way by means of a thousand silver streaks. Whose waters have long nourished the Travanian hinterlands, and so provided for a settlement of learned souls from across the northern sea. To the city of Shadi, that great seat of knowledge, now abandoned by her keepers, they go. This is always such a great zone. Yeah, it's a nice zone. Especially because of what's lurking underneath that bubble over there. What the? Ooh! I see. The big bubble off yonder distance. Yes. Ah, oh, name the current. No! Leave me alone, weird plant thing. <laughs> the weird plant thing likes us, apparently. I remember this zone, and I remember it well. It's a fucking huge zone. Mm-hmm. There was a lot of quest lines to do here, too. Yeah. Fortunately, we're not doing them. Mm-hmm. Thankfully, we don't need to. This zone sucked back in the days of doing um, the uh, the fate grinds because the fates were just so spread apart. Yep. Oh, 
Ah, uh, we can't actually get close enough to see what's uh, underneath the big bubble. Oh, I yeah. I forgot you can't fly into the water. Oh, yeah, that's right. Or can you? I don't think you should be. Oh, huh. Oh. Hmm. No, you can't go in the water. Oh. Uh. It's only housing, like, the best summon in all of Final Fantasy. Yep. Alexander. But we'll get that another time. Well, it's still a main story fight, right? No. Oh. It never was. It's the rank. Oh, oh yeah. Okay. Gaither current. Oh. oh, yeah, it's on the other side. Oh, yeah, the entrance. I am going to lick that aether aetherite so heavily. What? The one in Edelshire? Yes. Considering it's the only one in the whole fucking zone. I know, isn't that so idiotic? There should be like two of them, but what do I know? Right, well, technically there isn't actually one in this zone. It's in Edelshire. Yeah. Hey, it's a tarantula hawk. Hello, Mr. Tarantula Hawk. Oh, okay. Fine, don't be he friends. He didn't. He didn't aggro. How odd. Let's try that again. Hey, Mr. Tarantula Hawk. Yay! Look how ugly they are. Oh, I, I leveled up by walking. How can... Yay! Ah, yes, the beautiful power of zoning into everything. Oh, yeah. The bagpipe I got here first. <laughs> At least it's not dying bagpipe land. No, I actually like uh, this music. Yeah, so do I. Oh, well, it's gone now. Oh, yes, because they have to have a. Oh, wow. Got to speak for the wind.
That goblin is too happy with himself. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, all the goblins look like this. Yep. Uh, <clears throat> do yourself a favor. Google Final Fantasy XI Goblin Tinkerer. They're wearing crocs on their faces. Yes. Essentially, they are. Yes. But are the Goblin Tinkers in Eleven actually had proper cod pieces? Yeah, they did. I'm actually kind of glad that they don't have the same cod pieces in this game. Because those were a bit... Yeah. Great. Let's just say nobody would, uh... Question the endowments of the goblin. I think we just got drafted to be the help. Uh-huh. That's how it looks. Wow, I can't even get a weapon. Yeah, me either. Alright, I'm gonna go pick up the eat, right? Yep. Now, with only three minutes to go, I'm probably not even gonna bother picking up that quest. No. I think we should wait for that in case there's another cutscene. Yes. Personally. Although this guy might have an ether for current quest. Oh, oh, yes. Oh, it's the Wondrous Tales. We don't need that. Oh, Wondrous Tales. We, um, yeah, we don't really need it. I got bow okay. shock. You do. Anyway, yeah. <laughs> Shall I see who to write out to today? Oh, we have choices. We're going to write out to Rhea. I think that's the best idea. I'm just gonna look around and make sure that there's not anything else. You know, let's, uh, let's go straight to Leia. I think it's a great plan. Show her some support. Because that way, we can all hang out in her group. Because they're doing cyberpunk 
2077, which is always good. I still haven't finished that game. Yeah, me either. So yeah, we're going to raid over there.